Oh, it's you. Sorry if you're made to feel less than welcome, but we've had a bit of a catastrophe here. We've just lost our youngest team this season at the very point of victory. Pickle's still rigid with shock, aren't you, Pickle? Yes, well, perhaps not that rigid. Oh, come on, well, pull yourself together. The girls are safely home in Bournemouth, and the battle against the opposition isn't over by any means. You mean we're... Yes, of course I do. We're going on. Enter, stranger. There. That's what I like, a fresh start. Now, what's your name and where do you hail from? My name is Chris Green and I come from Ryslip. All right, Chris. If you've prepared for this mission, you'll know you need three to help, so... Uh, Master... Uh, pickle, not now. Master, it's... Pickle, I'm... there are times and this isn't one of them. There are certain formalities, protocol, etc. Master, it's Hordris. You know what he's like when he's kept waiting? Ah! Hordris, greetings! And the fair Sidris, too. How charming and how inconvenient. Uh, bear with us, if you will, and we'll just get this latest quest underway. You'd better call your advisors, Chris. Nicholas, Gavin, Simon. All right, now, whom is which? I'm Nick Connor. I'm Gavin Fernandez. I'm Simon Brett. Good. Now, much will have to wait, for we have uh, some important callers. Uh, what can we do for you, Hordris? Rather, Dungeon Master, it is what we can do for you. Unless it has passed notice, Lord Fear's recent behaviour has exceeded all boundaries of acceptable conduct. His attempts at kidnapping, blackmail, spell trapping, and other pastimes too vulgar to elucidate, have convinced one that one should seek positive alignment with the powers that be. One has therefore decided to dispatch one's beautiful and talented daughter to assist on this quest, thereby ensuring victory. Sidris is in complete agreement. Aren't you, Sidris? Yes! To what? Oh, yes. I think so. Oh, Master, couldn't Hordris do something really useful to help, like not sending Sidris to hell? Shh, Pickle, he'll hear you. <clears throat> we are overcome with gratitude, Hordris, and our new champion, um, Chris, will look out for Sidris. At least his friends will. Uh, farewell. <whistles> now, where was I? You know, a thing like that can quite put you out of your stride. Ah, yes, the equipment. Uh, thank you, Pickle. And now, Chris, you better take this knapsack. Uh, that's for food. And the eye shield. Uh, I think you know what that's for. And finally, the horned helmet of justice. You can't see much with it, I'm afraid, but then most of what you come across isn't real anyway, so perhaps it's just as well. There. Right. Ready for the off? Yes. Good. Turn then and take your first steps down the path. Okay, stop. Right, where am I? You're in a room. If you walk too far forward, you'll uh, fall down what looks like a pit. Well, the first choice is simple enough. Tread on one of these four symbolic paths and choose the symbol of the object you wish to redeem. What if they tread on two, Master? Then there'll be a clash of symbols, won't there? Right, give me direction. Should sure, go for the shield. Shield. Sword. 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 Yeah. sword. Which direction? Go left. Side. Okay, side, side step, step to your left. Keep on going. Keep on going. going. Okay, keep on going. One more. Okay, stop. stop. Walk forward. Okay, slowly. Stop. Okay, stop. In front of you, some hexagonals are appearing. Walk forward slowly. Keep them going. That's it. Walk okay, forward. Walk forward. Okay, keep going. Stop. Stop. Okay, turn 90 degrees to your left. Okay, so sidestep to your right. Walk okay, forward. Walk forward. Where am I? You're in a room. There's a door, black door, top right. 
Beside you, on to, just to the right of you, there's a long table bench. So here's okay. a scroll, a bar of gold, a mallet, I think it's a bar of silver, what could possibly be a magnifying glass, a bunch of grapes. Okay, there's yeah. some food there. Okay, take the food, Chris. Put it in your knapsack. Put it in your knapsack. Read the scroll. Yeah. yeah. Right, read the scroll. Pick up yeah, the scroll. Pick up the scroll. Can you see the scroll? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. What does it say? The... What does that say? Acme, Acme Persuader. Tap on tabletop to make new, new friends. friends. <laughs> Shall I put it down? No. Oh, OK. Well, I've read it now. OK. Yeah. Shall I take really? anything else? OK, Chris, lift up the spyglass and have a look. You know how to use that? Oh. Yeah. Hold it in front of the eye shield, that's it. Don't give me excuses, Scarkill. Just tell me that it's done. Uh, what's done, you fair ship? Uh, no chip. What do you mean, what? Did I not give you clear instructions as to the neutralizing of a certain hostile element? Short of carving it into your bad leg, I don't see how I could have been more explicit. Uh, begging your pardon, Lord F. Uh, I forgot about that. Uh, I mean, I've I done it for you. I just forgot to tell you I've done it. <laughs> anyway, she's uh, all boxed up and going nowhere. <laughs> lovely. Ah, boxed and locked, you say? <laughs> yeah, lovely. <laughs> Here, you know I've got a mouth on her, though. You should have heard what she called me. Excellent, Scarkill. Excellent. You must forgive me, I didn't realise you were so sensitive. Anyway, your hurt feelings are a small price to pay for what we've achieved. With her out of the way, there'll be nobody to ply their green monster with firestones, which means that our red death can move in on the action. Better yet, they'll be able to move out of Mount Fear, and not before time, I say. By the way, who's got the key? Uh, I'll solve it to that Julius Garamonger, like you said. He'll sell it to the Grimwolves. They always wanted an elf, especially a small one, all boxed up. <laughs> Here. What's that? Imbecile. That's the intruder alert. Someone is spying on me with a spy. Chris, put down the oh, buff. Put it down. Put down the spy glass. Okay. What put should down. I do now? Okay. What objects? Are, what objects are there? There on is the table a bar of gold, bar of silver, and a mallet. Take the car. You can take two objects. Yeah. Gold in the mallet, maybe? Yeah. About the, the, because we can bribe um, that person. I can bribe and hit someone. <laughs> Pick up the mallet and the gold. No, are you sure? Got it. You're about this hitting now, shall I tap on the table? Yes. yes. Yeah, tap on the table. table Chris. Even I know the difference between a table and a bench, Master, and that looks like it's going to hit somebody. Yes, I think you should get out very quickly. Okay, Chris, quick, Chris. Take, take some side steps to your left. Okay, stop. Stop. Okay, walk, walk forward, forward quick now. Stop. 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 Left. So I step to your left. That's it. Left now. And again, small one. Now okay. walk forward. Walk forward. Where am I? You're in a room. To the left of you, there seems to be a doorway. On the wall, there is um, a ball and chain. Um, in front of you, there is also a passage. On the floor, there are various items. Mm, well, Master, if Scarkill and Lord Fear have locked up who I think they've locked up, then it's no bad thing, if you ask me. In fact, no you ask... one is asking you, Pickle. And of course it's a bad thing. How's Chris going to get into level two without Smirkinoff's help? The descendant device is notoriously unreliable, just as likely to take you up Mount Fear. No, these are dangerous days. And we certainly don't want a red dragon loose in the higher dungeons. Right, walk forward. Stop. Make him go left. Yeah. yeah, go left. Turn left. Walk forward. Stop. I don't think these are very safe tunnels to uh, yeah. wait around. Turn left. Forward. Could just go forward. Well, Master, if that isn't old Julius Scaramanga, wasn't he responsible for selling his own mother to Count Brinkator as a washerwoman? A slight exaggeration, Pickle. 
They say he's taken to drink since that Chinese fellow opened his mobile emporium. Doing rather well, apparently. Well, come on, Dean. You can't let Chris stand around all day. Walk forward. Oh, stop. Hello, young sir. <laughs> uh, sit down a bit, why don't you? Eh? Try I've got nothing to sit down right in front of you, look, what's the matter? Try sit down? Yeah, yeah. walk forward and sit down. Yes, yeah, better, innit, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Julius Scaramunga, Master of Commerce, at your service. Not that I've got a lot of stock at the moment. <laughs> In fact, it's very hard to make a decent living right now, but with the likes of that oriental leathern barging in and undercutting the profits of a, an honest merchant. <laughs> What's your name? Chris. Well, I'd love to do business with you, young Chris, but it's like I say, I've got very, 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 very little stock at the moment, and uh, well, what stock I have got is uh, pre-pledged, so to speak, to a customer that... Uh, uh, it's not worth the likes of me offending. <laughs> well, what stock do you have? Well, it's like I say, I'm very, very, very low on it. Enough. Chris, I've got ask him if he's got the key. Do you have a key? Uh, well, as it happens, I've got a key, uh, but it's, uh, like I say, pre-pledged, you know, so to speak. Yeah. <laughs> got to try and bribe him yeah. to give us the key. Uh, Off. Perhaps a bar gold. of gold would make you change key. your mind? Oh, gold. No, I haven't seen gold in a long, long time. Oh, Try and persuade him, Chris, as much as you can. What's that? Try and persuade him as much as you can. Are you sure? It's a lovely bar of gold for the key. I'd love to help you out, but I can't. I, it's like I say, all my stock's pre-pledged, including that key. I'm very, very sorry. Are you sure? I'm very, 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 very sure. <laughs> Tap the mallet on the table. <laughs> oh, God! Goodness <laughs> gracious me! What, the, what was that in it? Oh, that must have been a thunderstorm or something. <laughs> now, the key. Oh. May I have it? No, it's like I say, I can't really let you have it. It is pre-pledged to someone else. <laughs> I'd love to be able to help Hit you. Hit it on the table again. <laughs> Now, may I have the key? Well, is it you responsible for that? May I have the key? Uh, well, uh, look, if you can make that thing that's hitting me on the head stop, uh, I'll sell you the key. Give me the key, please. Uh, for the gold? Yes. Oh, what a nice man you are. <laughs> Wait, shall I give him the gold? Yeah. yeah. Right. Yeah, give him the gold. Give me the key and I'll give you the gold. There's the key, look. Can you see that all right? Yes. Uh, 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 give me the gold. Oh, look at that. Isn't that a lovely, lovely sight? Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, thank you. Now, that this, this will be a great help with the little scaramongers. Well, I'll tell you what, why don't you get on your way and uh, if you happen to come across a bloke called Arwok, you might uh, try that thing on him, eh? Uh, excuse me, called who? Uh, Arwok, but take no notice. You won't be able to miss him. You know, got that? Him, so you know. Yes. Yeah. You've right. got his name. Nick, guide him to the right, door. Thank you very okay, much. Stand up, then. Oh, thank you. Ta-da, a bit. Let's do business with you. <laughs> Which way? Um, so I step right until we take... Tell you to stop. Yeah, keep on going. Stop. Okay, stop. Walk, Walk forward. forward. You're now entering a door. Walk forward. Keep on going. Where am I? Um, in front of you is a hexagonal puzzle. Um, each hexagonal has got a number on it, starting with two, then goes to three. Um, in the number. Oh, Chris! Oh, thank goodness I got here in time. Now, wait. The safe sequence for the causeway is eight thirty-nine fifty-one. I think, or perhaps that's the sequence for coming from my direction. Anyway. I've got to try and raise Smirkinov. Elite has gone missing and so no one's been feeding him. But you must hurry. It's unstable. The causeway, I mean. Good luck. Okay. Right. Make sure that it isn't the one from her direction. Yeah. No, it's okay. not. It's yeah, in. Right. Okay. Right. Each to the right until we take say stop. Stop. Okay. Walk forward until we say stop. Stop. Inch right till we say stop. 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 Okay, walk, walk forward, forward till we say stop. Stop. Inch inch left till we say stop. 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 Okay, walk forward. Oh, left, inch left, left, left. Yeah. Stop. Okay. So. 
game today. Right, inch, inch left. Inch left. Yeah, yeah. At the scroll. 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 Yeah, scroll. inch left. Right, yeah. to the left Kate, of you. Can you see the scroll? Seven. There's a scroll. I do not see a scroll. Okay, okay. Chris, turn, turn, turn left. left. Can you see it yet? Yeah? Yes. Okay, we can it. Don't, don't read don't it. Don't step yeah. anywhere. Yeah, and you can pick it up. Pick it up. Go and just pick it up. I can't pick it up. Got it. Okay, don't pick it. Don't well, read turn it. Okay, turn right. To right. Yeah. Turn right. Okay, inch right till we say stop. Okay, okay. Well, forward. 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 Forward till we say stop. Okay, stop. Okay, inch left, left till we say stop. Stop. Walk forward. forward. Inch left. Stop. Inch left. Okay, inch, inch left. left. Keep going. Keep going to left. Okay, inch left. Stop. Inch left. Inch left. Okay, walk forward. Now stop. Inch left. Inch left again. Walk forward. Stop. Where am I? Um, you're in a room. To the left of you, there is a door. Um, in front of you on the floor, there is something on the floor. Yeah, yeah. I think it's food, Chris. Is the room safe? Yeah, there's yeah. no one. Hey, walk forward. Safe enough to read the scroll. Yeah, yeah. yeah, read the scroll. Open it up. Right, the scroll says... One word, it's a spell. Passport. OK. Have you got that down? Yeah, got it. Right, I'll put the scroll down. I think you should keep it. Okay. Walk forward, Chris. Okay, see what's on the f There's on something on the floor. Is it food? Got it, food. Yeah, okay, put it in the Something's appeared in front of you, Chris. It's a blocker, I think. Passport. Passport. Yeah, it's gone. <laughs> it worked. It worked? Yeah. Yeah, it must have been his password. Walk forward. Turn left. Yeah, yeah turn to the left. Walk forward. Hey, okay, walk forward. Where am I? Right, in front of you there's a large chest. Also, next to that, to the left of it, is a, seems like a stool with clothes on it. Yes. Chest. Might it's be the box lot. where that person is. Yes. In what else is there? Um, in, fr um, in front of that there are two houses. Take him to the chest. Yeah, right. walk up to the chest. Walk up yeah. to the chest. Walk forward. Right, stop. I see a chair with some clothing on it. Okay, turn right Look. a bit. Yeah. Right, okay, walk, and walk forward, forward until you get to the there's chest. There's the chest in front of you now. Is it like a keyhole or anything inside? Yes, there's a lock on the bottom. Yeah, okay, try and open it then. Open it with the key. Right, try it. Yipes! Ouch! Oh, excuse me. Oh, pins and needles. <laughs> oh, you'd have me for being locked in there. No. You let me out, did you? Yes. What's your name then? Chris. What are you doing in Wolfenden? We're on a search for a sword. Oh, really? You don't look tough enough to be a dungeoneer. <laughs> you don't look bright enough either. <laughs> there, Master, what did I tell you? Rude, ungrateful, hardly worth rescuing at all. If you ask me, you didn't ask me. Well, if you're bright, you'll be bright enough to tell me what's been going on. And why Lord Fear set his gruesome goblin master onto me? It's about the dragon. You tell her that, that Lord Fear's got um, a red dragon now. And it's a green dragon. Yeah. Lord Fear has a red dragon which he intends to release onto dragon. one of the levels. Gosh, not a red dragon. Sounds like we better get to Smirky fast. Yeah. Quick, give me a hand. I know a shortcut. Well, I would, wouldn't I? <laughs> this way, come on, Chris. Mm -hmm. We've got time to lose. Come on. <laughs> come on, Chris. Oh, no. Somebody's left the door locked. Good job I know how to open it, isn't it? Porter's Parabellum! Okay, see? Come on, Chris, we haven't got all day. Now, for goodness sake, watch out for his spines. <laughs> Looks like we're just in time, Chris. Smirky and all. Smirky, are you ignoring me? Why not? It may have passed your attention. But a certain someone has ignored me for days. It could have been weeks for all you cared. Oh, smirk a north. Oh, elf boots. Now he's sulking. Well, you can sulk all you like, but just get us to level two first. Come on, Smirky. Flying time. Oh, very well. Are you going to stand there all day? I do have 
other things to do, you know. <laughs> Come on, Chris, you better get into the saddle. Now, gently does it. You get over? There you go. Now, you better hang on tight. Smirky's not the safest of drivers. <sighs> OK. This is going to be a short flight, as I haven't been fed recently, in case you haven't noticed. Just flying over the sea at the moment. OK. I'm sorry to leave things up in the air, so to speak, but it's the rules, you see. Time obeys certain rules, and so must we. Stay with us here on Challenge this evening. After the break, the brain buzz kicks off. That's Bruce's brain buzz with the prices right and the 8.30 player cards right. So all you digital satellite viewers, what you need to do is press that red button now and get ready to play along for free.